everybody, today I'm going to be teaching you about tectonic plates, tectonic plate boundaries. I don't know why I stumbled on that word, but here we go. And we're using Minecraft, so everything will be a lot simpler to understand. <laughs> um, but for my, the first tectonic boundary, we're going to be talking about convergent boundaries. It's where two tectonic plates, this one and this one, come together and they keep, when they get pushed together with the lava flowing underneath them, currents, using currents, they will, if they're the same density, they will get pushed up together and get keep on getting pushed up and form a mountain. Yes, I know I'm not very good at building mountains. And you could find this tectonic plate boundary anywhere where we have mountains now. For example, the Himalayans, Mount Everest, um the Rocky Mountains, and let's move on to the next one. This next one is transform plate boundaries. Yes, I know, I wasn't quite certain of the name when I first heard it, but it's where two plates sliding past each other. And yes, during in real life, where two plates are actually do slide past each other, they don't slide past each other like this. They, um, move past each other and are done with each other, except for this purpose, I can't make them fly off and go apart. So, this will have to do. And transform boundaries, you might be wondering, if the, if this boundary forms mountains, what would this boundary form? Well, I'm here to tell you what it forms. Break glass for an earthquake. Should I do it, Sparky? I think he says yes. Oh, no. Earthquake happened. Yep, you guessed it. Sparky's okay, which is good. Okay, but you guessed it. This boundary, transform boundaries, form earthquakes. And they happen all over Yellowstone Park, as you probably saw before I broke the glass and ruined the town. Let's move on before the state officials see that I wrecked Yellowstone. Now, our final boundary. Now, this might look like a turtle with no shell, no eyes, and just two flippers, and I did not mean to go for that look. Think of this as one tectonic plate. I know I screwed up miserably trying to build this, but it'll serve our purpose. One tectonic plate. And as they separate, they, a tectonic plate can break apart and split. This is called a divergent plate boundary. This this plate boundary can be found in any deep trench, like the Mariana Trench, or anywhere on the ocean floor. This happens when a oceanic plate and a land plate, I forgot what it's called, come together. The oceanic plate sits sparky. Is more dense, so it will meet. Oh, I'm just grabbing a different plate boundary, which I'll get into in another video. But for this one, where two plate boundaries split, magma comes up from the middle and forms more land on top. It could either cool in water, how it's done how this is supposed to be made for, except because of the blue, except I failed, but, or, 
it could be formed on land and the uh, air around it will cool it. And this will keep on building land above it as the tectonic plates keep splitting. And I believe that's it. Let's review. Two tectonic plates, same density, same density coming together, pushing against each other, going up, making mountains. And this is called a convergent plate boundary. A transform plate boundary. Two plates passing past each other equals earthquakes. Sparky is safe. And finally, a divergent plate boundary. Two plates splitting against each other. One plate splitting. That's what I meant to say. That equals a divergent plate boundary. Sorry, I paused for a second. Now I hope you guys enjoyed me and Sparky. We'd like to say goodbye to you. Goodbye.